One veteran is taking matters into his own hands, starting up a small business and giving back in the process. I'd like to welcome Ironbound Boxing founder and retired Marine Captain Michael Stepman. Captain, thanks for joining us. How you doing, sir? But thank, thank you right up front for your service. Oh, uh, thank you. All right, talk to us about this. The, the idea, you, you didn't even box until you went into the military, right? Yes, sir. I learned boxing at the Naval Academy. I was a three-time national champion, two-time most valuable boxer. Fell in love with it and uh, really loved uh, my teammates and the atmosphere created and really wanted to uh, mimic a program very similar to the service academies in low-income communities. So you, you, you got out of the military. Yes, uh, sir. And are you from New Jersey? I mean, this is in Newark, New Jersey, right? Right. I am not. I just had an opportunity to intern in Newark over a summer. Uh, fell in love with the city. Felt like it was uh, open for some change, you know. And uh, when I got out, I d debated between going to grad school or moving to Newark and starting an inner-city boxing program. Well, they call it they call it the Brick City. It's known as a tough, rumble, uh, you know, rough-and-tumble town. Uh, talk to us about how you're taking that sort of edge from the city and the youth there, turning it into a skill and even more. Yeah, so what we're focused on is training, educating, and employing young men and women from the inner city. Uh, we have a great partnership with the city of Newark. They were able to give us a free space to outfit, which we've turned into a boxing academy that trains uh, youth and young adults absolutely for free. And then one of the things I've built out is a corporate wellness business that teaches boxing to companies as a form of employee wellness. So a lot of companies in the New York City metro area are having uh, yoga instructors, meditation instructors to keep and retain talent. And we like to provide them with on-site boxing instructors. So we're creating an ecosystem where we're able to train kids for free in communities like Newark and then get them employed as boxing trainers in corporate settings. What aspects of the military are you applying to that, particularly when it comes to the kids? Uh, I think the first thing is leadership. Uh, you know, I think oftentimes in communities like Newark, uh, they can often be void of talent. You know, a lot of us go to college, we become successful, and then we tend not to move back to these kind of communities. So one of the nice things about the academy is it opens up uh, my personal life and the personal life of my coaches to the kids that we're serving. So I like to call it that transparent leadership and also being in the fight. You know, it's a lot different when, you know, the kids can see us downtown, when they can right. see us in the community, as opposed to just kind of coming to them and telling them what they should be doing. Right, they and, know you're a, a part of the fabric of that community. Absolutely. And, and that's keeping it real. That's keeping it real. And the other thing is just the grit and determination. You know, it's been real, a real blessing building out Ironbound Boxing over the last few years as the kids get to watch the growth. You know, so they've seen me come into a location right. with no ring, no right. nothing, and now they see us on, you know, Fox News. All right, Captain Stepman, I'm going to say thank you again for your service. Congratulations and God bless. It's I appreciate a beautiful it. thing you're doing. Ironboundboxing.org. Yes, sir. If, if anybody wants to donate. Absolutely. They can donate there and they can also purchase some Ironbound Boxing gear, which we use to fund our free programs. All right.